the St. Matthew Passion is considered one of the greatest masterworks of Western art. Uh, first of all, the libretto provided to Bach by his uh, uh, favorite poet Picander, Christian Friedrich Henrici, is simply of the highest quality you can imagine. The uh, metaphors in the arias and, and the rest are simply uh, very, very um, well worked out, and, and it's, it's, it's uh, I mean, he, he uh, Picander apparently, he knew he was working for Bach, and, and he, he tried to come up with a language that, that was uh, suited for the occasion, uh, but also full of new ideas, of new images that, that uh, one hadn't read before. And the second one is that Bach, we don't know how, but he came up for this piece with, with a very um, distinctive musical tone. The, piece, uh, the music you hear in the St. Matthew Passion, if you think of the opening chorus, if you think of the great arias, is novel in every respect. This is something uh, he hadn't tried out in his cantatas before that. It's, it's somehow a new tone of, of um, uh, it's, it's colorful, it's expressive to a degree that even Bach hadn't, hadn't uh, achieved before. So, so it's, it's really um, the attempt to make this piece um, the climax of the entire church year.